Now, what kind of experience do you like to see in your applicants? Clinical, research, and or service they underserved? Those are all important to medical school. What about sure the MBS are. program? They are. Um, and, you know, we'd like to see them as well. I mean, ideally, a student is coming into MBS program, having good clinical research, you know, having some good clinical experiences, maybe has done some shadowing, has done some patient facing, you know, work has demonstrated a commitment to, the, to their community through some volunteering and has that already. It's just like the GPA thing from undergrad um, that we can help, but that's not always the case. And medical schools, dental schools, you know, it seems like more and more they want applications are looking for this more and more, you know, most students now, I think in going to medical school, the number, the percentage of students that are going straight out of college is decreasing the numbers of students that are taking one, two gap years is increasing oh, just yeah. because they're trying to fill in those other things because most schools are doing that holistic review where it's not just undergrad performance. It's not just an MCAT. It's like, okay, what are what are these other things that you're doing that, you know, are hopefully going to, you know, fit with the mission of the school, you know, whether it's like social justice or whether it's volunteerism or whether it's, you know, a dedication to like urban medicine or rural medicine, all those things you want to be trying to demonstrate. So if a student can come into MBS with those and can focus on, you know, doing the academics here, doing the coursework, great. If not, um, those are sometimes the students that end up, you know, okay, doing MBS and then not applying directly after that, but taking another year to then, okay. And like, that's the advising we try and give them is to like, okay, sort of assess where, where you're at. Cause you're like and same advisors that are, you know, on the admissions committee and are on the MD admissions committee are also advisors in our program. So they're, when you, students in our, in our program here are getting, they're getting a lot of advice from like actual admissions people that tends to help them. Mm -hmm.